This is David Savile. Now, what are your non-negotiables in life or in your career? I just got back from a coaching day uh, with a client and we went to, we walked through London. So we went from Southwark Bridge where I caught some sun um, through to London, through to Tower Bridge. Um, we stopped in a coffee shop, we stopped in a place to eat and we just did some deep, powerful coaching. Uh, it wasn't, it's never about where we are, it's about what we're doing. Now, it's the last time that we met a month ago. Um, there are a couple of themes that came up and that was integrity and intuition. Um, and he wanted to lead, become more of a leader. Now, he's been living into his integrity and intuition and it's amazing how fast he's grown. He didn't even realize it, but he's been leading. He's, bec he's becoming the leader that he's always wanted to be. And it's been, he's been growing so fucking fast. It's just, it's mind boggling what he's done. Um, and then today, um, we're, the, the themes for today, because whenever I'm doing a coaching day, I, I, like, to come, I like to create a couple of themes um, that, that come out from the person I'm coaching. And today it was uh, non-negotiables and possibility. Now the non-negotiables were to do with he's, he's reached an impasse in the place he's working. The environment is not for him, the people are not his people. So he's looking for something new and exciting. And to do that, we, we spent a lot of time diving into his non-negotiables, as in the things that have to be present or the things that cannot be present for him to work for the next uh, place he works. These are things that when he goes for his interviews, like starting next week, he's going to be interviewing them about these non-negotiables to, to see if they can match up to his, to what's important to him. If they can't, he's gonna move on. He's not gonna let himself be in a place that doesn't hold true to his values any longer. And again, this is him stepping into his leadership, into what he wants for his own life, and it's fucking powerful. Now, the other thing we dived into was possibility. And the poss we, we created an impossible vision, some exciting things for his future that just a few weeks ago would never even crossed his mind. But as this is what happens when you grow, when you change, and when you, when you start making things happen, suddenly things occur to you that never, that you couldn't even think or conceive of before. And now he's got an impossible vision that he's starting to create now. You know, this isn't something for the future. While he's going for this other job, he's, he's got his own future business that he's gonna start creating now, something really fucking exciting. Um, but he gets to live it, you know, he gets to create it. In fact, one of the tasks that I set him was to set, send me his new vision, you know, because it's completely evolved from even just yesterday. His vision yesterday is a fraction of what it is today. That's how fast things are changing. And in, in fact, we spent about seven hours together today and seeing his transformation was fucking powerful. I mean, I, it's like, I said to him actually, it's like, it's like probably what Jack, Jack and the Beanstalk had with his beans, right? He planted the beans in the ground and the next day they shot up into the sky. It's like I could see his beanstalk growing in front of me, you know, he was he's growing right there and it was amazing to watch. So yeah, that was his non-negotiables and possibility. And the thing is, when you're living through your non-negotiables, when you're living through your values, it's, it's easier to see possibility, to see what you want for your life. And, and it's a beautiful, wonderful thing. So my question for you is, what are your non-negotiables? What in your career or in your life are musts, are things that you have to have in it for you to be true to yourself? And what are the things that you, that you cannot have in it, that by having in it go against your values? And check in with that. Are you living through them or not? Are you being true to yourself? If you're not, I encourage you to straight away start changing that. He, in fact, is going to go, while he's still at the current role, he's going to bring his non-negotiables into it for the duration of his time there to make his time there more impactful and so he can start living into being more true to himself than he is right now. And I encourage you to do the same. So comment below. I'd love to know or message me directly. What are your non-negotiables.